This is Alan Eland from Tel Aviv Airport. In this video, I'll show you how you get by train from Tel Aviv Airport to Jerusalem or to Tel Aviv. Before we start with the video, please make sure to thumbs up to the video and subscribe to the channel if you haven't done yet and if you want to see more Israel-related travel content. Let's start with the video. The train is an easy, convenient and cheap way to get from the airport to Jerusalem or Tel Aviv. There is a direct train from Tel Aviv to Jerusalem and back. The train passes the airport and stops there. So you get on this train at the airport and go one way or the other depending on your destination. Trains run every 30 minutes during the day and every hour at night. You can get to the train station from the arrival hall of Terminal 3, which is on level G. Tickets are available from ticket machines or at the counter. You can switch the language to English at the machines. You can buy a paper ticket or use a chip card, the so-called RAFGAF card. For everything you need to know about the RAFGAF card, watch my video on it. To buy the ticket, charge the language. Select your destination and then the ticket. You can add more tickets if you wish. To get to Tel Aviv I pay just 9 shekels, that's a little over 2 dollars. The machine displayed 18 shekels for the trip to Jerusalem. You can get to the platforms through a barrier system. Inside the ticket or hold it in front of a scanner. Be sure to keep your ticket. You need it again to leave the terminal station. There are four stations in the Tel Aviv metropolitan area that are directly accessible from the airport. The journey takes between 12 and 27 minutes to the fourth stop, Tel Aviv University. The train to Tel Aviv departs from platform 2. You board the train towards Herzliya. Herzliya is the terminus. Before that, the train reaches Tel Aviv. To get to Jerusalem, go to platform 1. In Jerusalem, the train stops at the terminus. That's the station Jerusalem Itzak Navon. The journey to Jerusalem takes 24 minutes. By the way, Jerusalem Navon is one of the deepest train stations in the world. If this is interesting for you, check out my video about it. It is important to know that there are no trains, no buses, no trams on Shabbat. Shabbat is between Friday evening and Saturday evening. It is the day of rest in Judaism. Times may vary depending on the season and the position of the sun. If necessary, find out more on the internet before you drive. If you arrive on Shabbat, you can still take a taxi or a cheaper shared taxi. I wish you a safe trip to beautiful Jerusalem or Tel Aviv. Guys, if the video was helpful for you, please give it a like and don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you haven't done it yet. Wish you a pleasant stay in Israel. See you in my next video.